Are you praying for your children's future spouses? Hello, this is Kathy Riker with tips for living well together to build strong families and strong people. This week's topic is praying for your children's spouses. Shortly after our daughter Hannah had married Joshua Tomlinson, we were honored to be invited to visit. Their home was lovely and blessed, a wooded two-bedroom apartment, carefully chosen close to East Carolina University, where Josh was studying for his master's degree. It was decorated beautifully with Hannah's flair and Joshua's musical instruments adorning special corners of the apartment. On Sunday, Joshua's parents, Captain David and Cindy Tomlinson, returning from their own road trip, joined us for Hannah's spaghetti dinner. We left feeling the restfulness that God designed into a godly marriage for them and for us as their parents. Joshua's mother had told me that she has been praying for Hannah and me since Joshua was born. Here is a beautiful poem she wrote inspired by the famous biblical couple Isaac and Rebecca from Genesis 24 entitled, A Jar on Her Shoulder and love in his heart. Show kindness to my son, O Lord, I prayed upon my knees. Bless his sweet Rebecca, wherever she may be. Bless her as she comes and goes. Bless the strength that's in her hands. As she fulfills her daily duties, a part of God's master plan. Bless her parents' household, as this girl they guide and shape and her heart you are preparing to meet her future mate. Keep our daughter covered, Lord, with modesty and grace until the day her veil is lifted and we behold her face. Our Isaac is a strong young man. He works hard in his field. His heart is waiting patiently for his love to be revealed. Please make our journey successful as we watch for our chosen one. When with your hand of blessing, the two shall become one. Next to making Jesus Lord in your life and receiving eternal salvation, choosing a spouse is the most important decision in any person's life. Your children's choice will affect you in so many ways, from Christmas celebrations and grandchildren, to financial lifestyles, to peaceful or strife-filled relationships. This is a truly important area for prayer. With the heart that Cindy Tomlinson had for that boy in her poem, and the Lord, it's no wonder he caught my daughter. I'd love to read your thoughts on praying for our kids' future spouses. Please leave me a comment and click like, share, and subscribe on YouTube for more tools to help your family thrive. This is Kathy Reichel. Thanks for tuning in.